What's up, everybody? This is Steven Zakila bringing another reaction video, and it's been a long, long time since I watched anything of Ruby. <laughs> um, the reason why? Well, if you guys didn't check out my last episode, which was episode three of Reaction with Ruby, that was recorded three or four weeks ago, and I was just swamped with things one after another of like reaction videos and some other stuff and um, also the holidays and whatnot so I accidentally forgot to edit that one and I lost track of time and I just kept putting up other content over it and scooting it to the side because other things were more important and right now I believe there's like episode 7 or 8 right now and I'm on episode 4 I haven't watched anything of Ruby in a while so, sorry for such a long, a long break from Ruby, but I'm here, I'm back, uh, looking forward to more Ruby, so let's get to the video and enjoy it. Well, last time, uh, if I remember correctly, because I put, uh, I just, when I uploaded it, I edited it the day before I upload, so I actually was able to rewatch the editing process of episode 3, so last time... Um, Weiss had her sister show up, Ruby had her uh, Uncle Crow show up, and they duked it out as they duked it out, Ruby and Weiss cheered on their, uh, uh well, Ruby cheered on Crow, Weiss uh, cheered on Winter, which is a, her sister, and it was just an all-out fight, and then the general showed up stopped it but she got in uh winter got in trouble because crow put away his weapon which i thought uh, and if i remember correctly it looked like it was about to turn into a a scythe which she learned from crow how to use a scythe so he should he honestly should be using the scythe last time he was using something uh that looked like a uh, devil may cry 4 someone told me the actual name neo or was it neo I don't remember, but whatever the character, it wasn't Dante in Devil May Cry 4, and it's been a long time since I played the game, so I I, just, I can't remember the fucker's name. <laughs> it's been so long on so many other video games and so many other things have happened where that memory or that name has just been pushed out of my ear because of all the other shit that's been happening over the years. Um, but lettuce, lettuce, why did I say lettuce? Let us enjoy the episode four of Ruby, and I'm gonna try to have these uh, these go up pretty much. I'm I'm gonna have this episode go up real soon. Well, you were watching it, duh. And episode five will be really soon, and maybe episode four. I mean, uh, four, six, and seven uh, next week or the week afterwards. Not one after another, but maybe really near each other, only a couple days apart, so I can catch up and actually be on time with when the episodes are released on Rooster Teeth. So without any more delay, let's enjoy this video right now. Alright, if I skipped it or edited it out, we're back. <laughs> if I didn't, hope you enjoyed it and let me know if you want to keep it in. Yeah, we are going to see finally these two fight after such a long time. That's right. Good luck, you two! Hey, Bunny Girl's back. A lot of people like that character. Oh wow, they get four elements now instead of two. Huh. So now instead of it being four on four with two element hey. lands, it's now two on Lucky two with four outfit, elements. Kid. I'll try not to get blood on it. Uh, I can't promise you'll leave without a scratch. I won't be the one bleeding. Oh, I like her. She's cocky, but she's evil, so she's gonna win. Ooh, Gatling gun! Well, if you ever need your lawn mode, that's one of the best ways. Huh? 
gotta be some good shoes to press against a sword like that without being yeah, cut. But where's the girl? Oh! Don't shoot him in the dick. What kind of maneuver was that? That was cool. Damn! Coco. She just got fucking Scorpion! Get over here! They're getting separated, which is probably not a good thing, because that guy alone was able to kick both their asses. Oh, shit. Damn, that is a long chain. Oh, she broke my shade. Uh, she broke her shades. Now she's going all predator on her. And with that final blow, Yatsuhashi is eliminated. What? Wow, so she can shape shift or something? Damn. Damn, she went all fucking scorpion slash pre Oh, that would be an interesting combo. A fusion of scorpion and predator together? Ooh. Damn. Mortal Kombat, get on that! <laughs> You're leaving? Yes. I was merely needed to oversee the transport of additional units to Vale. Our last shipment was lost to an ambush. I believe you had a run-in with its cargo, actually. It's fortunate those paladins were still in the prototype stage. Otherwise, your team may not have fared so well. Weiss, you've done well out here on your own. Finally, she doesn't she act like proud. a bitch towards her sister. I'll be honest, it was quite amusing seeing Father's face the day you left for Beacon. I can't wait to show him what I've learned. Oh? And what do you think you've learned? What do you mean? I'm getting better and better with my glyphs. I've even started time dilation. And what of your summoning? I... You know I can't. Don't be ridiculous. Every Shni has the ability to summon. We have for generations. I've tried! It's just... It's the one thing I'm having trouble with. We Shnis are unique. Unlike many, our semblance is hereditary. But that doesn't mean that it will come easily. Your semblance is like a muscle. The more you practice with it, the stronger it will become. But if you only focus on one aspect of it, if you fail to test the limits of what you think is possible... Whoa! They can do they that? Never truly grow. <laughs> You're nothing but talk, kid. You can do it, Ruby! Oh my god! <laughs> oh yes. Total annihilation! Ouch. And by the way, don't ever call me old. <laughs> <laughs> now, where was I? You were telling us about your last mission! Right. <laughs> I don't know why, but Ruby always makes me smile because she's so funny. Right they really do a good job with their character. Right. What were you doing there? Needed information. Tired from battling Grimm along the way, I decided to start my search at the town's inn. 
The place was crawling with lowlifes and thugs, even a few huntsmen that I could only assume had been hired by less than reputable people for less than respectable jobs. And that's when it happened. What happened? I was defeated by the mere sight of the innkeeper's skirt length. Oh my god! <laughs> That's <laughs> two out of three. So, Uncle Crow, did you get in trouble with Ozpin? Nah, me and Oz go way back. We're cool. <laughs> cool for an old guy. Not funny. Hey, so what are you doing here anyway? I thought Dad said you'd be away on a mission for, like, ever. Well, a professional huntsman like myself is expected to get results as soon as possible. Yeah, I get that. <laughs> We're pretty much pros, too. Oh, really? Yeah, read the news sometime. We totally saved Vale while you were gone. Funny, because I heard Vale suffered a grim attack after you almost managed to stop a train. But they don't give out medals for almost. They do, and they're called silver! Well, we helped take down Roman <laughs> He's locked up in Ironwood's ship, and crimes been down ever since. That's basically a bounty mission. Sure, you may be acting like huntresses, but you're not thinking like one. You really think four girls and their friends could end all crime in a kingdom? Plot armor! I didn't you said that. Violence hasn't dropped since Roman got nabbed. It stopped. Completely. No white fang activity anywhere around the city. You cut off the head of a King Taijitu, but now the second head's calling the shots. Oh god, has I dropped? <laughs> can't get through that thick metal head of his. You know the general? Hey, I know everybody to some extent. Remember, you're talking to a member of the coolest team to ever graduate Beacon. <sighs> team Stark. That's when I met your parents. We were pretty well known back in the day. Well known for crummy fashion sense. Hey, we look So now yeah, well in and the I intro you can see it, the picture that he's holding. Back but that up. Lot, lot cooler to see but Ruby's I'll mom a little up close now. <laughs> Anyway, I'm too old to be hanging out with a bunch of kids. You're gonna cramp my style. Look, just remember that you've still got a long way. Hey, there's Zine. And don't think or for Ein. a second that graduating is it Zine? means I can't done. remember. Every day out there is worth a week in this place. You two, you're gonna go far, but only if you keep learning. If you never stop moving forward. Excellent form. Now think to your fallen foes, the ones that forced you to push yourself past who you were and become who you are now. Think of them and watch as they come to your side. I can't. Stop doubting yourself. I'm trying. Damn, she bitch slapped her. Trying? Then you have no hope of winning the tournament, let alone succeeding as a huntress. Why don't you just move back home? I'm sure father will give you a nice job as a receptionist. I don't need his charity. But you do need his money, don't you? What? How did you know about that? Lucky guess. I may have been in a similar situation when I joined the military. So what have you done this time? Well, that's the thing. I'm really not sure. I went to pay for lunch the other day, but my card didn't work. Oh, I remember that. Embarrassing. I know. Well, it was. Why would he cut me off like that? Perhaps so you'd stop avoiding him and call home. Emotions can grant you strength, but you must never let them overpower you. It sounds to me like you have two choices in front of you. You can either call him, beg for his money back, and explain once more why you want to study at Beacon over Atlas. Or you could continue to explore Remnant, discovering more about the world and, honestly, more about yourself. Start earning your money, basically. It's time for me to go. It was really good to see you, Winter. 
Until next time, sister. Uh, she was able to summon a sword. That's about it. You gonna answer it? All right. That was pretty good. Uh, I'll cut this part out, see if there's anything at the end. Well, there was nothing at the end, guys, so I just probably just jump cut that. <laughs> well, pretty good episode. Really good. Um, finally, her sister actually doesn't seem like a snobby bitch. And uh, actually gave her some good advice. Beg for the cash or earn on your own and show him up. That you don't all that you don't need to, to listen uh, to basically follow your own path is in a, in a quick sense is what her sister what told her to do and rely on him or don't but if you rely on him he's going to expect you to follow his his wishes and she doesn't want to do that so pretty good uh, overall really good episode love Ruby's uh, videos by Rooster Teeth. Um, fantastic. Link in the description below if you guys want to watch this on your own. And until the next reaction of Ruby, I'll see you guys later. Oh, and also subscribe. Thanks for watching this video, everyone. Hope you enjoyed it, and if you want more, check out the description below. Hope to see you guys in a later video. Also, have an awesome day.